muscle spasm. I wonder if your mom ever had second thoughts of keeping you when you were born. Miss Roberts, may I speak with you? I'm fine, Miss Lucas. Then why are you crying? Look at these bruises. They're horrifying. What's going on, Melanie? Every time I see you, you have a new bruise on you. I'm just clumsy. I, I walked into a lamppost. My dear lamppost must be jumping out at you the way you're getting all these bruises. Melanie, I want to help you. Help me understand what's going on. Have a good evening. Miss Roberts, if you need me, I'm here for you, okay? Just remember the rules, Melanie. Deny or die. Deny or die, what a choice to make. Deny all knowledge of Jillian Thorne and Kate Killigan and their destructive ways, or be killed for confessing I'm a victim of their tormenting. Miss Lucas, may I speak with you? Yeah, I can't believe she's actually standing up for herself. That takes serious guts. What do you think Kate and Jillian are going to do when they find out? I already know what they're going to do. They're going to kill her. After all, that's the rules. That little save it. She's going to get it. Thank you for confiding in me, Melanie. I know it was very hard for you to do. Now I need you to go and get ready for class, okay? okay. Heard you snitched, Mella Freak Show. Enjoy today, Melanie. After all, you know perfectly well what happens when you don't deny. <laughs> I lived by the rule, deny or die, for the last three years. No one ever made an effort to smile at me in the hallways or give me any reason to believe that this rule would no longer control my life. Nobody wants to die, I guess but nobody wants to feel terrified their entire life either.